So I grew up on a beef cattle farm uh, that my grandpa owned. Uh, we were very fortunate to grow up right across the street. So he had 120 acres or so and was just a straight cow-calf guy. Definitely that's where I got my love for agriculture. Um, and that's why I chose to go into the animal science field um, for my bachelor's degree. Ended up in Arkansas and currently I own and operate three different companies. So my primary company that I devote most of my time to is called Smart Reproduction. It is a sheep and goat semen and embryo import and export company. Um, so what that means is we take elite American genetics and make them available to the international market. Um, our center is special um, because we're the first um, facility that was inspected uh, with a special multi-country um, accreditation and then we're the first and only company um, to pass the EU certification process. So originally um, Smart Reproduction was a division of B&D Genetics uh, which is a company uh, my former husband and I owned and operated together. And the way the international side of it came about, actually, I had to find a reason to bring people from all across the nation to Cherry Valley, Arkansas. And I looked at other industries that I was familiar with, such as the beef, equine, uh, swine industry, and the, the beef and dairy industry is huge in import-export. And I wondered why the same wasn't true for sheep and goat. So I kind of mimicked those industries, developed my own protocol and got it approved with USDA, which is how we have the, the multi-country accreditation. And uh, it was all to bring clientele to Cherry Valley. So the second company, which uh, I guess I've owned and operated the longest is Delta Livestock Diagnostics. And so for it, it's a domestic company. We service vets and farmers, producers, backyard farmers even, and they send in samples that they or their vet collect for pregnancy and disease detection. So we're making those testing services affordable for the everyday producer and we have clients from coast to coast. Our, our goal, I guess, with all of the companies is we want to make the world a better place through livestock agriculture. So I have a six-year-old girl, Kendall, a four-year-old boy, Rhett, and then I'm expecting a baby boy here just in a few weeks. I want to expose them to you know, a wide array of things. Uh, for now, Rhett says that he wants to be a scientist and a chef. I'm cool with either or both. Uh, so right now they are inter interested and I hope uh, being around it every day, which they are, you know, fosters that love for agriculture and for science. But even if they don't, at least they got exposure. And as long as that exposure helps them be successful in whatever field they choose, you know, that's, that's a win.